How y'all doing? What you were saying? Today was just, it was like practice. A lot of y'all ain't believe in us. Even everybody asking me questions right now, which is crazy because you just got to understand our coach, Coach Prime, my dad. Everywhere he went, he was a winner. Every game, every opportunity, he took advantage of it. So a lot of y'all don't have, I'll say, the same knowledge and the same experience that he has. So how could y'all question what he's saying? He been out there, he got a gold jacket, he playing Super Bowls. A lot of people have it, you know? So I feel like now y'all understand that what he's saying is real, and y'all understand what he's saying. And yes, I'm, I came from an FCS school, SWAC school, but to me it's no difference. Them hits still feel the same at all. I mean, I knew we was gonna do this. The scoreboard just telling y'all that, you know, that's what's going on. But y'all ain't believe, nobody believed that we was going to do this. So we was fighting two battles, I'll say, for the team. I, I get off social media pers personally and let my brother, Deion Jr., uh, the well-off media account, let him run it in my uh, YouTube. I let him run that stuff. But I lo I'm locked in. I'm focused. I'm not listening to what everybody's saying. You know, your dad came in here and sat down and said, you're so proud of you. Yeah. It just feels like another day in the office. We did it last year. If you go back and look up the numbers from last year, they was pretty high versus FAMU. So you knew, you should have known number game one is a lot for sure. <laughs> you should have knew that. I got too much time to prepare, too much time to focus. Uh, our OC coach, Sean Lewis, had too much time. I mean, I grew up in Dallas, not Fort Worth. It's a difference. It's a difference between Dallas and Fort Worth, but it's cool. It's cool. I, we live in the outskirts, so we're not really too much from the city. We don't really be here like that, but I'm just excited to, you know, share this moment with my dad, knowing that at the end of the day, I knew I had his back. Everything he's saying, I'm going to back it up, and I'm going to make sure I do that. So I feel like my, my journey, my career, everything so far, it was just the steps to, you know, get me in this moment so I could take advantage of it. Yeah. I mean, I was, I was just a swag player like two weeks ago. <laughs> I was just a swag player two weeks ago. So that's just for y'all to talk about. I'm just, you know, we're going to enjoy this win as a team, but it's definitely we got to we gotta go play the corn next week. He been the same player since last year. This is the thing, it's just it's just it's just crazy because it's like everything that we done in the past, it's just we did the same thing, it's just magnified now. We just had a bigger level. So if you go back and look look at the old games, look at everything like that and look at what we did, then you'll be able to understand what's gonna happen. He played offense and defense last year. So it's the same. Mm -hmm. oh, it doesn't feel like nothing to me because it's the same recipe, same same preparation, same things we're doing over and over. It's just magnified now. Y'all able to see. It's more cameras and stuff, but we had the same things at our old school. The way we travel, the way we eat, everything. It was the same thing. The only difference now is that it's media and everybody's grabbing the headlines and stuff like that. Did anything feel different today? Nah. Not, nothing really. The only, I'll say the only difference between FCS and this level is the D-line get off bl blocks if you try to scramble up faster. That's it. Everything else, you got good players, you got good DBs, good receivers, everything like that. You just have more of those on the, on the field at once. You got to think, everybody on the field ain't going first round. A lot of people on the field may not get drafted. So don't let people fear names. I don't fear names because I really don't care. But that's the biggest thing. When you fear names and, and you let 
that's half the battle. You already losing. Dang, we playing TCU. I respect the university. I respect everything about them. But personally, I just never cared about names. It was cool, but it wasn't up to speed. It wasn't like it's crazy that we put up the numbers and we wasn't even at our best. I missed two deep balls early. Um, silly penalties, but it's our first time really growing with each other, trusting each other, understanding each other in a game like in a real environment. Now I knew Dylan was gonna be real special, just by what he does in a scrimmage and like the, we get amazing looking practice. We get prepared amazingly. Like everything that our coaches prepped us for and told us was gonna happen, happened. It was nothing out there that they did that really surprised us. We just didn't execute everything. So I was really satisfied. I was pleased with how we played today, but it's definitely, it's a lot room for improvement everywhere.